Sorry about that. I accidentally hit a button on my phone and it stopped recording for just a second. So the second half will have a couple parts to it. We are in the second half here. And Black is winning 7-4 to four with 16 and a half minutes to play. Oh, Blue finished that one well. So now the score is 7-5 to five for EFC. Or, I'm sorry, for uh, Surf 09 pre-NPL. Black team winning. Still plenty of time to play. 16 minutes to go. And Black is on the attack again. Good dribble, shot, and great uh, kick save there by Tyler. dribble. Good interchange by Blue and a good finish. Now it's down to a one goal game again. <clears throat> Blue working their way back into the game here. Header away by Tino. And look at this, Nate has got space to shoot. Blue covers back so quickly though. They had three bodies behind the ball before he got the shot off. They've been trained well to get behind the ball after a transition in play. Oh, great shot. Renzo off the crossbar. Tino's gonna have one? No, he'll play it back for Nate. Nate trying to fight his way through. Plays it across, looking for Gage, but Blue cuts it out. Says it's a black kick in. Uh-oh, giveaway in the back, but Blue can't find the net. That's a black kick, or it should be. So Gage will have to bring the ball way back up here. Ah, we gained a few yards, it's okay. Turn shot by Gage, couldn't find the net. Blue with a toe poke. Body's falling all over the place there. I think that the ball must have hit the ceiling because it's uh, called on the side. And now uh, some substitutions being made for Black. Ryan and Luke are going to make their way onto the court. Renzo and Nate are going to sit down for a drink of water.
That is a kick in on the side, she says. Great idea. Oh, now Luke almost has a header. It was a great scoop by Ryan all the way across the court. Luke had his hand up looking for it. Tino shoots. It's blocked by... Oh, it's going to trickle out. Great interception there by Tino. Uh-oh. Blue is on the break. And they almost finished. They should have finished. They did finish. So we've got a, a tie ball game here, I believe. It's 7-7 uh, seven to seven with 11 minutes to play. And we're in for an exciting finish. Anybody could win this game. There's goals at either end of the court. So now we're playing with Luke and Tino in the back. Gage and Ryan up top. Let's see if we can make something happen now. Oh, no. Luke got through, but Tyler saves the day. Great ball gauge for Ryan, but Luke defends well. Another scoop to the back post. Ryan's got that down, but Gage couldn't find the net on the volley. Press that ball, Luke. Get your toe in there. Don't let him dribble around you. Luke plays it back for Tino. Tino for Ryan, a 1-2. And then into the space for Gage to shoot. He pulls his shot. That was beautiful, though. Everybody on black involved with the play. That's what we like to see. Uh-oh. Bad giveaway in the back. Maradona. Luke tries to stop him, but the boy fights through. If he finishes this, it'll be embarrassing. Oh, my heavens. Blue beat both Gage and Luke on the sideline. Got the ball down the court and then finished to go into the lead now. 8-7 to seven for the blue team. Luke shoots from distance. It's not going to trouble their keeper. He saw it the whole way. Hey, Paul, what team is this? It's, uh, yeah, this is, um, in black is this, uh, 09 Surf pre-NPL, and in blue is, uh, EFC 2010 Fixo. Shot at the near post by Ryan. Good blast, but the keeper saves it. Great stop there by Tino. Very physical game. Lots of challenges all over the court. comes out of bounds. Uh-oh. Blue turns his marker and gets the shot off. Great block again by Tino. Blue corner. Luke for Gage, for Ryan, too much mustard on it. Luke is in space to shoot, he toe pokes it and it nestles into the near post. And so now we have a tie ball game, eight to eight with eight minutes to play. Very exciting game here. The score keeps flip flopping. Ryan steals the ball, but Blue cleans it up, plays it all the way down to Tyler Coffey, who resets us. Oh, I think that was a foul, but uh, maybe not. Maybe he went through the ball and, and I know she's going to give a free kick. Wow, Tino shoots from within his own half and actually hits the outside of the upright. That was very close to being a... A very long-range goal off the free kick. Uh-oh, Blue's in space to shoot now. Wow, Tino not only blocked it, but then put it out the side to prevent the corner kick. Or up the side. Ryan for Gage. Gage for Ryan.
shot from distance. Tino, does it go over the keeper? No, it goes into the keeper's arms. Good idea, though. Tino goes on a dribble. He dishes it out for Ryan, who's in space to shoot. Blasts it in the upper 90. He's excited about that one. Runs back celebrating. They're all celebrating now. Oh, somebody's got to go off the court. We have too many bodies on. And now we've got the substitutions made. And so it's going to be Renzo and Luke in the back. Ryan and Nate up top. And uh, score is 9-8 to eight for the black team. With five and a half minutes to play. Kick save, Tyler. Blue corner. Shot. Oh, Luke. Did not control the ball when it was played to him. And so it's out for a blue corner. Blue scoops it into the keeper's hands. But quickly redistributes for Nate. Who couldn't keep it in? Had a great shot. He pulled it just an inch wide of the goal. Luke steps in front of it, plays it back for Tyler. And we restart. Lorenzo for Nate. Nate looking for Ryan. That'll go out for a blue corner. The boys are communicating well, everybody making sure that they're marking somebody. They all know what they're doing. They all have responsibility. Blue plays, plays the ball across, and, and Tyler does a good job to, um, to block it, but it will go out for another corner. Second ball played into the area, and it's going to be a black kick in on the side. Luke for Ryan, back to Luke. Looking to put Ryan down the line. Ryan for Nate, who's going to play it backwards for Gage. He's going to shoot with his left foot, but keeper saves it. Three minutes to play here in a one-goal game. What a dribble by Nate. And he plays it for Ryan in space, who finishes with his left foot. That's a goal. Lasso. Great team goal there. Started with some great individual skill from Nate. You might want to watch that dribble back on slow-mo. And then uh, Ryan with the incredible left-footed finish. Oh wow, Blue capitalizes on a mistake in the back. And so we're back to a one goal game. It's uh, 10 to nine with two and a half minutes to play. Black is leading here. Another good dribble by Nate. He's looking for a pass. Renzo, Ryan is calling for the ball. He's in space there at the back post. Renzo for Luke. Oh no, Luke has a mistake in the back. He redeemed himself there, but he did have the ball taken right off his feet. Luke thought it was his kick in. Oh, great steal by Nate. He plays Ryan, but there's just not enough space there. Luke heads it down for Ryan, who flicks it onto Nate. Can Nate finish? Blue defends it well. Luke for, Kate, for Renzo now, Renzo for Nate. Renzo back for Nate. Man, the boys are just working in tight spaces here, moving the ball around very well. Yeah. 
Renzo, oh, Ryan's in space. The shoot and the blast, it goes off the post and out. Man, that was so close to being a, another goal for Ryan there. One minute to play, and it's a one goal game. Black is leading. Anything can happen in the final minute of play here. It's gonna go out for a blue kick in. Luke knees it away. He kicks it out. Oh, keeper's out. Ryan and Nate are in. Nate is gonna finish that. No, it's off the post. We have an exciting uh, finish here. 20 seconds to, to go with just one goal separating the teams. Is Blue gonna get another chance? Oh, he can't keep it in. 10 seconds to play here. Oh, look at that. He spots the keeper out, but it's not going to count because it didn't touch anybody. Of course, a kick-in is an indirect. And that's going to be the end of the game there. So we win by one goal, 10-9. to nine. Very exciting game.